today we were making the Dord ornaments, which is... It's going to be bubbling cauldrons. Today, you will need... Hoplet. Um... Little fella. Okay. From Dollar, Tro Dollar, Dollar Tree. Tree. Blue sticks, also from Dollar Tree. Twine from Dollar Tree. And these little cauldrons from Dollar Tree. And you will find these around St. Patrick's Day. And, and paper towels from Kroger's. Yes. Okay. First. You need to grab a bunch of paper towels, at least one, I mean one, roll it up into like a ball, like and put it into your cauldron. Like this one? Yes. Now just put it into your cauldron. I'll do this one because it fits. Yes. Because it's a Dollar Tree. Yes, and you're gonna have to keep the handle up because if it's down, down and when it, you glue it, them on, you won't and it you won't be able to get it back up. And you yeah. want to make sure that it's up. So the twine can go on, on the, the handle. handle. Okay, first, first we glue them here. Onto the paper towel. Mm -hmm. So it looks like it's actually coming from the coat. Okay. First, we need to apply hot glue. Okay. Okay, right there. So you need to place it on the paper towel and then you continue doing that until you can't fit any more into it. We don't want them to see the paper towel so that and we don't want them uh, to use our, our box so we use the mini ones too. Yes. All of the mini ones look like this, or they're a little bit bigger. And you need to fill in the gaps that the big ones don't fill in with the little ones. Okay. It's about to be my turn. This is real looking. I'm gonna use gold and green. Your turn, baby watermelon. Mine is Polyjuice Potion, and if you don't know, Polyjuice Potion is a potion that you can turn into someone else with. Like, say you had a hair of baby watermelon, and you made the potion, all you would have to do is drink it, and then you would be baby watermelon for an hour. Keep baby watermelon. Remember, keep your hand all up. Good. Okay. Now all you need is a couple more. Okay. Draw for your bit finger. Baby watermelon. Okay. I 
hope it's It's a mini one, so you need a watch out for your bingo. I'll take that. Okay. Okay. I got some glue on it. Baby Waterman, what potion is yours? Mine is a yacht potion. <laughs> okay. That's cool. Mine's a polyjuice potion. So you will find polyjuice potion in book number two of Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. And you will find yacht potion in book, I don't know, <laughs> Harry Potter and something something. We haven't read that far. So far, we've only made it to the sixth book, and we're going to read the sixth book this summer. Okay. My cauldron is dripping down a bit. It's overflowing. And mine is not doing that yet. Here you go. Hey. And now the Pokemon. So you take it. It's okay. the favorite okay. one. Okay, I'll hold this. I hope he takes turns with the hot glue gun. You need to get an hour of it. Yes, my turn. An hour? I don't think I need an hour. I need an hour. I get an hour of it. Here you go. After one glue, you get it. And after one, your one glue, I get it. Okay. I'm getting started on my second one, which is Wolf's Bane. I'm gonna use gold and brown. And if you don't know what it, what it is, it is actually a potion that we leaves werewolf symptoms. Now I'm going to start my second one. It's going to be the Truthful Veiling Potion. Okay, here you go. I'm about to finish my second one. And then I will have to put the twine on. Okay. Now for my last one, which will be a small gold, and there! Here you go, baby watermelon. Now I'm gonna add the twine. Okay. This one. Now I am going to. You would feed the twine through, then done match up the ends, then tie a little knot. And there you do it, go. You have your bubbling potion ornament. And our kitty's here. She wants to make one. 
We don't have enough room for a kitty. Okay. Okay. Here's my second one. So Professor Umbridge asked Professor Snape to make some vert serum, a truth serum, so she can use it on the students like Harry. And it was in book Harry Potter and the Order of Phoenix, the fifth. And Wolf's Bine was in Harry Potter and the Prison of Azkaban. Snape made it for Lupin because he was actually a werewolf. I'm as, finishing up mine. As you can see, they are all different. And you can make yours with whatever way that you like. And I think that they will be a great addition to our Harry Potter Christmas tree. Okay, now let's add some twine. A little bit longer. Okay. Now we need to slip it through. Find the ends. Then tie it in a knot. And then you have an ornament. Yay. Comment down below if you remember who gives Harry the love potion and Harry Potter and the half blood prince. And give us a huge thumbs up. Subscribe down below. Come back tomorrow, tomorrow to see what's next ornament's gonna be. Bye! Bye.